Now this is the interface of uh, ETAP software. Uh, software is done by CSI Limited, and uh, I can show you the the interface. I am going to explain the icons and basic tools and menus um, which are needed to uh, develop a model. Now this model you can see is a pre-developed model by me. This is a 10 story building although it's called 10 story there are 10 plus uh, 2 stories for machine flows and water tanks and uh, etc. So it's around 12 story building. So uh, this one was done by me for a government hospital of Sri Lanka which is to be uh, developed uh, I mean constructed in the premises of um, Candy hospital premises. So this is done by me. Now uh, I'm going to explain the interface. Now this is ETAP's 2016-16 model. Its model number is indicated here in the left top uh, as 16.0.3. So there are some variations in the versions. Uh, now 2020 version is also available. Uh, this is the file name 6 load applied. Uh, why I have uh, used this 6 is usually when I am doing a model using ETABs, uh, I usually save them in by putting this type of numbers, serial numbers. I put 1 and uh, say uh, grid only. After I preparing my grid, I usually uh, save the file. After that, again uh, finishing the next step, again I save the file. If we practice this method, uh, when you need to make a change in this one, because the architects today, architects, they always change the design. So if you need to change it, you can go to previous step where the, the change, uh, change should be done and you can do only the part after that um, saved file. Otherwise, you will have to do everything and you will have to do uh, the, the model again from the beginning. So, it's useless. That's why I used this uh, method. Now, your menu menu bar is in the top here. File, edit, view, define, draw, select. Likewise, you have everything here. So, the main thing is here. Uh, analyze, analyze menu is here. When you need to analyze the software, you have to use this.